I'm coming. Hold on. <sighs> oh, wow. It's just you. Hey. Yes, I did feel rushed. I had to literally run out the shower and everything. I'm getting loser. <laughs> you caught me at the right time. I just got done with my everything shower and put my robe on. Come on in. Well, thing number two isn't here right now. She had to stay late for work or something. I'm surprised she didn't tell you yet. Uh, where are you going? You're already here, so just stay here and hang out with me until she comes back. I promise I won't bite. Like last time. <laughs> Are you coming up or not, loser? You're so goofy sometimes, you know that? Anyways, welcome to my lovely renovated abode. Thank you, I know. I'm changing. Why? In front of me? Yes, in front of you. It's not weird unless you make it weird, you fucking fruity rascal. I know I get hotter every year and all, but you getting flustered of me changing even though you've seen me change multiple times before? Wow, you boost my confidence up even higher, and that's quite dangerous considering I'm already a Leo. It has been a while, yeah. Especially since I decided to transfer to another college far, far away. <laughs> yep, you didn't see me here for the first few weeks of summer since I was all the way in Spain with friends. So that's even more of a while without seeing you. I missed you though. So you're just gonna chuckle and not say I miss you back? Wow, I heard you loud and clear. <laughs> I'm fucking with you. From what I heard from my sister, you asked a lot about me. <laughs> what? She told you I was at a boot camp? That's funny. Oh no, she knew. I think she just knew that I wanted to be off the grid and wanted it to be a secret until I came back. But boot camp? <laughs> Damn. I think she was still pissed at me for eating the last mango she was going to use for a smoothie. I wanted to be off the grid to be perceived as mysterious, obviously. Also, because I naturally don't like telling people my business when it comes to location. <sighs> people on campus there are either in a three-fucking-year relationship or just want to hook up, so i rather say to myself... If I hooked up with someone once? That depends. Who's asking? Okay, for real, I did. Only once, and I told myself never again. I did a one-night stand, and... You know I'm not the type of person to even do shit like that, since I only sleep with people I'm emotionally connected to, and also because I don't like people in general anyways. My mindset for that time, though, was new campus, new me. And let me tell you, never again. I'm pretty sure that girl said never again too because I woke up and kind of didn't know she was still in bed because I thought she'd leave the apartment by then. And I punched her in the face. <laughs> kind of funny though. You're correct. Typical me. How about you? A girl was trying to get at you? I mean, did you like her? <laughs> Nothing. Um, anyways, did you change your major like you said in our last conversation, I believe, or was it just a thought? Really? Wow, look at you. Yep, still and will always be a filming major. Just really speaks to me. But school is fun there, met really good friends, and it's kind of nice to be far from home. Although I low-key want to transfer back. I guess I do get homesick once in a while. I mean, 
I couldn't even fly for Thanksgiving, so I was quite pissed. Plus, if I get to transfer back, at least I get to see you. You know exactly what's special about you. Your famous brownies. I miss them so much. <laughs> what else did you think I was going to say? I'm kidding. Officially, I meant you. You really brightened my day. No, I'm not laughing at you. Well, I am, but it's because I noticed when you're flattered, you sit her a lot right after and I think it's just cute. And it seems like I flatter you a lot. Do I? Why are you looking away? Am I making you nervous? Not supposed to do what? Yes, I think and I'd hope I'm aware of you being my sister's best friend, but we all grew up together, so how is that relevant? Even when we see each other and we're out in public or with my sister, you would stare at me and I'd stare at you and we just pretend we don't know that we're looking at each other. And we're older now. Can't hide our feelings forever, right? And if you're not comfortable with being open, it's just between us. Oh, please. You know exactly what I'm talking about. That's why your cheeks look red as we speak. Don't you feel the need to kiss someone with such tension? <laughs> I was just getting my body missed from behind you. Tease you? You're bugging your lips when you haven't answered my question. I need a verbal answer. Would you like to kiss me? Then do it. I'm sorry, uh, I didn't mean to pressure you and I mean... I guess I was wrong about you. Come here. I never expected you to... You have me baffled. <laughs> yes, I was serious when I said I missed you. Obviously, I miss other things in general, but I do think about you. Especially considering you are my sister's best friend, so I can't really escape from you that easily, can I? She probably might get upset, like, Why do you like my best friend? There's so many other people that I'm friends with. Blah, blah, blah. Oh yeah, she'd probably get pissed at you too. <laughs> I'm not kidding. Hey, it's not like we're making anything official or anything. Let's just see how it goes, right? I don't know about you, but I still am processing you kissing me. Grabbing my chin and everything. <laughs> Especially coming from a shy person. I guess it's hard processing things you wish happened since a long time ago that when it does, you're speechless. Oh, so you want it to happen if you're nodding. And you're acting as if I didn't know what I was talking about? <laughs> Cute. Me? Being jealous? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I know, it was hypocritical. I just, I didn't know I wouldn't be prepared to know who other girls you're fooling around with, is all. You're right. My bad. Well, I'm glad we're on the same page. Should we kiss again? Okay. Shit, it's my sister. 
Nah, I want to be alone for a bit. She pissed me off yesterday. Thanks for the invite, though. Well, hit me up whenever you want to get to know each other somewhere. Later, loser.